Well, now I screwed the whole thing up. All right. Go. All right. Are you ready? Yeah. Go, Vink. Wow, good catch. We're going to catch and not the fling, I think. Give it to Hops. Hops, get it, Hops. Hopper, get it. And there you go. Go get it, Hops. Go get it. Get the ball. There you go. Now bring it over here. Spit it out. Good job. Good job. Think. <laughs> no. Works better in practice, think. Almost have a circus act. <sighs> Whoa. Whoa. Uh -oh. <laughs> think, why do they call you Team Chaos? <laughs> Vink's a little on edge because the elevator repair guy is here. But the dog elevator will be working soon, Vink. Darling Shmi, how are things today, my baby? You're so good. Oh, you needed like a flip and a rub. It's one of those days. Sideways affirmations. You're so good. You're the best dog and everything is going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay? If we want to hang out on your side in the bed, that's a great way to spend the day. You do what makes you happy, and if this makes you happy, I'm all for it, my baby. You're so good. Yeah, you're so good. Okay, today's a bedtime day. I think that's great. Good catch, Queso. Today, rock's looking pretty good. What do you think? I know you're thinking about it, even if you're not looking at it. You're sidling up to the rock. What's it doing there, Hops? What's that rock doing? Hi, babies. Bye, babies. Bye, love you, bye. Hi, Hops. I'm gonna give you all a quick coconut lesson. This is a coconut palm. Coconuts hanging on it. This is a bunch of coconuts that we've collected. Uh, the green ones like this, these are turning slightly yellow, um, but if you take them off the tree and they slosh when you shake them, like this, then you can cut the tops off and drink them. And then after about a year, they mature and they look like this, uh, which is the same thing. And then if you cut all the outside part off, on the inside is the nut. So that's like what you're probably used to seeing at the store. It comes in there and there's just a bunch of like fibery husk. It's really hard to get off. You take that off and then you get a coconut like this. If you want to eat it, it has a little face on the top and it's all really hard except for this little hole where the mouth is. You can poke that out and uh, then the coconut milk on the inside comes out and then you can crack it open and eat the flesh. Or if you're hops, you can just eat the whole nut, right? So y'all have requested some tours of the house now that we have furniture. Uh, we finally got all our last bits, so this is the bedroom now. Comes complete with your very own Schmieg. Pretty cool. Very pleased. Schmieg, you're the best part though. Living room. We have a couch now. Protective blankets. 
couch is good. It holds three or four dogs and two humans. And uh, we got a big compass up there. Dining room is about the same. Kitchen, still brightly colored. I don't know if I even showed you all this, which was the world's ugliest bathroom, but I redid this. Redid the countertops, redid this part. Put some octopus knobs on there. New mirror, decorative octopus, shower curtain. Real proud of this. I'm gonna show you how to husk a coconut. There's our coconut. This is this awesome coconut husking tool. I got it from Thailand. It works great. So let's make a video. There's the coconut. The rest kind of pulls off. Well attached, though. There you go. Hi, everybody. I missed you. Hi, Shmi. Oh, you get dinner time? Maybe it is. Bank, what do you think? What do you think, Bank? Is it dinner time? All right. What's she barking at? Hops. That's Hops. You don't even know what you're barking at. It's Hops. It's fine.